Hey guys, I am showing you our um, Cougar fifth wheel. It's a 32 BHS and I'm going to go inside. You'll have to excuse the mess, but we're going to go inside. And I'm going to show you what our rig looks like. Um, I do have to point out that we did buy these steps to put on it. This is not what came with it and we highly recommend these steps. In fact, you'll notice that our um, half bath or our full bath back here, um, we really want to get the steps for that one too. Um, we really enjoy these steps. Okay, so you come in, and here is our kitchen area, living area, TV. We have some storage up here, and some storage down here. Some of them do come with a fireplace, but we like the extra storage. Um, and we've got a big pantry here, and this is where we keep some of our stuff, which we still have to figure out some options as far as shelving, because the, as you can tell, they're very long. And it would be really nice to have some shelving in here so we can store some extra stuff. And then let me open this one down here. And that's where I keep our utensils. Thank you, Emma. And then down there, we've got extra storage too. And then again, up here. This is mostly where we keep all of our food items, some appliances. Okay, now I'm going to walk you into our bedroom. And this is what I really love about this one. Um, we have plenty of storage in here. Um, and then we've got a full wardrobe over here. But my favorite part is we have a half bath. So we have our own bathroom right in our bedroom, which is super nice. And it comes with, you know, your sink and, of course, your toilet there and it's got some storage underneath there too with the medicine cabinet and then let me open these here for you and here's it's got a bar that goes all the way across which is super nice for hanging your clothes up and on the side of each bed there is a cabinet below each bed also to keep stuff in and it does have a nice size window and here's a better view of our kitchen. And, of course, it looks like my kids left my freezer open getting their popsicles out. Um, there is a new stand right there that I bought from Ikea. I plan to use it outside to put our shoes on. And our new Ikea, um, I'm not sure what you call it, but I'm going to mount it where it'll hang on the wall, hopefully, if it's not too heavy. Um, the only thing is, is right here, there is some drawers. Um... In our last camper, we had an open area where we put shoes at, which was super handy. Um, and then here's the couch, and it does make out into a bed, which is nice. And then we've got our dinette. And then there's the bunk room, which our other one just had bunks. It didn't have a bunk room, but which we had a travel trailer, not the fifth wheel. And then we'll go in here, and there's a couch down here, and of course it flips out into a bed. And there's a bunk here. You've got storage. They've got a TV that goes there along with some more storage. And then another bunk with storage underneath it. And another bunk with storage underneath it, which is super handy. So all in all, you could probably see sleep for young kids comfortably. And it's got a window here. Another favorite part is more storage here. And we usually use this for a linen closet. Carter, you can go ahead and open that up. And here's where we keep our towels, extra sheets, washcloths, and then as you can tell, the bottom, you can't, we still have plenty of room. We need to fill those up. We've got the kids' sleeping bags down there. <laughs> and then it's a baby doll. Okay, and then here is our bath. And of course, it's just a regular full bath. And what I really like about this, we did buy the um, shower extender for the shower curtain, which I love. Um, I did want a stand up shower, but this one is super nice. It, it does have plenty of room, plus the tub for the kids is extremely handy. My favorite part is the 
door to the bathroom. So a lot of the times we camp with groups and it's really nice if we're all at my camper because then people can just come in and use our bathroom because we do use our bathrooms. I know that some campers do not use their bathrooms in their campers, but we do. Um, and then here is our kitchen. It's just got the regular little size fridge, plenty of storage. And as you can tell, we do use this quite a bit. Microwave, sink, um, another favorite item you can see that's sitting in my sink is a little Keurig, and that's another favorite part here. Um, and then, of course, storage down there, which, like I said, excuse our mess. We need to kind of tidy up in here. And now we'll walk outside to another favorite part of my camper. Which is the outdoor kitchen. Um, yes, there is a grill pull out, but my husband does not like us to use this because it causes a mess. So we do have a black stone that we take with us when we camp um, and use it. Um, my favorite part is we do have a fridge. We have plenty of storage up here in the sink. Um, we are campers and we like to be outside a lot. So this is nice. The kids can just grab them a drink. If you're cooking, you can wash your hands and then it gives you plenty of storage up here also. And we did buy an ice maker. That's another favorite thing that we've got um, that we like to take with us camping so we don't have to keep buying ice. And here's the back of it. We've got the rack, which we like to put our bikes on, and then our poop hauler, which we got to use one time. Um, we did realize, if you notice where the um, lights are the last time it was our first trip we had it down too low but somebody let us know that they couldn't see your turn signal so we did move it up and then we'll go around the side so you can see our slides and there's the bunkhouse slide the living room slide and then the slide of our wardrobe to our bedroom if you guys have any questions, um, please comment below. Make sure you follow our page or our YouTube um, and hit the notifications so you can tell when I post new videos. Thank you.